Hi there, it's Budget with Mama Bear. Thanks for stopping by my channel. Today we are going to be stuffing our Christmas binder. Yay! I have saved up a lot of money to put into this binder because like y'all know, we are behind. Um, so I wanted to make sure we did a special video just to stuff our Christmas binder to make sure we're sticking or staying on track so we can fully fund our Christmas without using the credit card this year. Okay, so how are y'all doing? Um, over here, <clears throat> I have $125 in our little cash tray. Um, you know what, I'm gonna move this like this and then that way I can put my pen in here. There we go, look at how pretty she is. This is from Erica at Making It Bling. This is, I got this last year two years ago. I don't remember. That is my Christmas pin. All right. Um, so let's see where we left off. There's our cute little dash. <laughs> I just love Christmas. So I had so much fun putting stickers on this. Um, we left off on the Ho Ho holiday. That's why I have this out. Well, that makes a lot of sense. Okay. So we are working on this one. This book, this challenge book is great because it's from the Thrifty Sewist and there's so many Christmas challenges in here. You can definitely use it year after year. <laughs> okay, so let's go ahead. I'm gonna use our red bling to in honor of Christmas. And let's see what we're gonna do. Five, so one, two, three, four, five. There's $3, let's do another one. Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. So three and a Santa. Santa's are ten. All right, because that's what I said. <laughs> so we're going to do ten, eleven, twelve, and thirteen. All right, this Santa's going to go off to the side there. All right. And we'll put our book away for now. How many of you are saving them for Christmas out there? How you doing? Keep at it, keep at it. All right, five. This is a roll and save from the Almost Organized Owl. And we'll put a five, let's do one more. And six, so that's $11. 10, 11, 12, Let me know down below in the comments how you're doing on your Christmas savings. Are you sticking on track? Or maybe you're saving for Hanukkah. Are you sticking on track for that too? I had a friend growing up and their family did Christmas and Hanukkah because of their parents, two um, religions that they were. So I was always jealous. <laughs> um, all right, so on this one, this is Kittens Without Mittens. This is from Liz and Les. To finish this, we would need $21. Do we do it? Do we do it? I say yes. <laughs> I heard you. You said yes too. All right, so 21. Let's get that out first before I forget. Because this yarn ball said 12 and this one said 9. All right, so there's 21. I'm gonna put that over here and I'm gonna get our last two little kittens. And we'll put them on here. This was such a cute challenge. I love her sticker challenges. <laughs> All right, and that one. All right, so a couple things we need to do when we finish this challenge. First thing, ding, ding, ding. We finished it. <laughs> so let's put one in here. All right, from Donna, Powered by Creativity. Let's put the money in here for now. And then I need to get my Liz book out. <laughs> so this hasn't been out in a while because it takes me a while to finish her challenges. But this is where I put all the stickers when I get it for her challenges. I still have more I have to add to this. Um, Pretty soon I'm gonna need to use the inside. <laughs> and so we've finished the beaver, we've finished the bear, and now we're gonna put kittens without mittens. So if you don't know, these are stickers in itself. 
And so I made her a book so I can keep them in here because I love stickers. So she has her own book, right? And then if we get to the end, we can use this side. And all the Liz challenges are in here. So Liz, this is your book. I don't even know if she watches my videos, so <laughs> it's okay. All right, so that is done. So we have to count the money and we're gonna add it to our front folder. Ooh, there's some ones in there. We're gonna use those. First, let's do that so we don't have to sit here and count them. Okay, that's 10. Okay, so we're gonna put 10 ones and we'll take a 10. All right, that's better. So let's see how much this challenge is because it's pretty chunky. 10, 20, 30, 40, <clears throat> 50, 60, 70, 85, 95, 96, 7, 8, 9, 100 dollars. Yay. <laughs> so we go to the front, and this is where we keep all of our money. We're gonna write it on our little budget sheet. Plus 100, so now we're at 241 finished. And we're gonna add it in here. Let's see, I, I like to organize my money. And let's go ahead and count and see if we've got 241. 50, 100, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200. 10, 25, 35, 36, 7, 8, 9, 41. Perfect. So $241 so far for Christmas. All right. Now let's, where, did, where were we? Where were we? So we will have to add another Christmas challenge in here. Maybe we'll have, if we have time, we'll do it at the end because I have a ton back here. So let's go on to our next challenge. And this is from Girl Mama Budgets. Let's go ahead and put 15 in and do one of the skates. All right, so that's right here. We need the red. We're just coloring in the 15. 30, 40, 50, $60 left to finish this challenge. So we're almost there, about halfway. All right. It's gonna be fun when a lot of these start to finish and then my number goes up for my total because I get a little nervous, but then I remember, well, there's a lot of money in these envelopes. <gasps> We're gonna finish this one, yay. Okay, hold on. This is my winter savings challenge. This is in my shop. We're gonna do the last one. This is an $80 challenge. And the last one is a whopping 10 bucks. Good job, Mama Bear. <laughs> At least we already did the 15. All right, so five and 10, ring that bell. We're gonna put a dollar in, put the ding, ding, ding challenge. All right, so yay. Um, I'm gonna put that aside. And oh, we have the extra scratch off. Let's do this. This is from the Thrifty Sewist. She sends these in with her challenges and I always keep them. And this is an extra $2. I thought it matched the winter. I thought it matched this really well, so I put it with it. Thank you, Wendy. All right, so we're gonna do $2 extra. So that's 12. So let's go ahead and count this one up and then we'll put it in the front. 20, 30, 40, 55, 65, 75, 76, 7, 8, 9, 80, 1, and 2. $82 because we had that extra 2. Let's add it on here. We won't count the big pile again, but I do need to use the calculator. So we're at 323. Yes. It's looking good. Remember when I told you? When they start to finish up. Yay. All right, and I will organize that one later. Okay, so we finished two, yay. All right, let's see what's next. Are we gonna finish three? <laughs> this is how long it's been since I've had this binder out. I don't even remember where we were at. So this challenge is from Whimsy Designs by LB. 
Um, and there are two left here, and they're each $5, so we're going to finish it. Yep, we're going to finish it. Ding! <laughs> I feel like dinging today. All right, so there we go. $1 for there. And did we? Oh, uh oh. All right, let's count it because I don't remember if we put the money in here. <laughs> I don't think we did. So there should be 60. 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. No, I didn't. Okay. So there we go. $60. Finish that one. Let's put it in the front. Wow, that's awesome. This makes me hopeful whenever I finish one. So we're at 323 plus 60 is 383. I could have done that in my head, but I'm just so excited I can't think. You know how that is, right? And because we, oh no, actually when we hit the 500 mark, I'm putting this in the high yield. So this will get chunky a little bit, but that's okay. All right, is this one gonna finish? Nope, we just started this one. <laughs> so this one is from Magnolia Grace 88. Such a pretty one that she sent me. It's a pink wintry house. It just reminded me of Christmas time. And we're gonna roll the dice on this one. Five, so one, two, three, four, five. Oh, she's got the fancy numbers. So I don't know if that's a one or a seven. Let me look, that's a seven. All right, so we'll stop there. Nice. And I don't know what this one's gonna end up being, but the numbers are one through 10. It's so pretty though. This envelope has all my, my uh, savings challenges for Christmas. So we'll go and put three in, maybe more. I don't know, we'll see. <gasps> maybe more. <laughs> this one's been staring at us today. This is my freebie that I gave out with my Christmas cards last year. Um, it's a mystery and we only have two more and I made it low income because I wanted it for everyone. So let's scratch. Ooh, seven. You know what? Let's finish it. Why not? And three, which is a 10. We can do that. Yay. There we go. How many is that? You tell me. I forgot. <laughs> that was a lot. Well, I guess we'll find out when we have to fill them back up. All right, $10. Let's see how much this mystery was because it was so long ago, I forgot. <laughs> 5, 10, 15, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 30. Oh yeah, I made it a $30 challenge. <laughs> so we are done with that one. All right, let's add another $30 in here. Plus 30. So let's see. We still have the 383 on here. We went over 400, so we're at 413. We are almost to that first $500. Yes. Oh, that's exciting. That is exciting. So now we need a new one in there. We are back to the ho-ho holiday. Love it. If we get to one that we finish, we're gonna to have to put it in. So let's go ahead and roll the dice. If we get any more Santas, this might take all our money. Three. So we stopped at this Santa right here. One, two, three. Two dollars. Let's do one more roll. I just can't. Oh, come on. You've been doing so good. <laughs> three. It's probably because it has the bling on it. One, two, three. Ooh, $6. Okay, so that's $9. Let's see if we have a one and we'll put 10 in. One and we'll put two fives. Perfect. Alrighty, that's enough for you. And I gotta fix my little castle here. Okay, what do we got next? Oh, it's a, <laughs> hopefully the castle works for me. Come on. Um, this is the roll and save from the Almost Organized Owl. Three. We finished that row. All right. I am moving along. And we have our first empty one. So let's go ahead. 
I'm going to close my eyes and choose. <laughs> it's a sticker challenge. So this sticker challenge from Liz and Les, I started a while ago and then I had to stop and empty my folders. So we have three on here that we have to put the money back in for. So let's see how much that is. So we've got five and six is 11. So we have to do $18, but I don't have 18. So we'll go ahead and just do five and we'll cross that five off so we know that we did it. And then once we get caught up, we can continue to put our Christmas trees on. Perfect. All right, and then the next one. Oh, oh, this is good. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. But I only have a 10 or a 15. So here's what we could do. We're gonna put the five in here. All right, we're going to color in the five on the 15 skate. All right, we're gonna put this back in here. Technically, we're not doing an IOU, we're just doing a partial. And we'll put our Santa here. So next time we know to start on this one and put that other 10 in. Wow, we did really good on our Christmas. That's so exciting how many we finished. I feel so good and better about saving for Christmas. Make sure you're doing that if you end up spending a lot because that has always gotten me into credit card trouble is that holiday. <laughs> it totally has. And last year I was better, but I didn't have it all. This year my goal was to completely cash fund my entire Christmas. That is travel, flying my kids home. Yeah, that's a big expense right there. Presents and food. That's pretty much what we do. Travel, presents, and food. My oldest is coming home this Christmas because I didn't get him last Christmas. So I've got to do two flights. All right. So I hope you enjoyed this video. We haven't done just a Christmas video in a while. So I hope you all like that. Um, let me know how you're doing with your savings. As always, I double love you. Have a blessed day. Oh,